Today in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a 3D text and without using any of softwares like S Cinema 40 and 3D, 3D Max Studio and we also have the ability to make a 3D text in Adobe After Effects CS5, CS3 and CS5.5 and CS6 so absolutely we have to, to types and to, to possibilities to make a 3D text in Adobe After Effects the, one of the possibilities is just available in Adobe After Effects CS5.5 and CS6 which is the geometry option we use a geometry option here in Adobe After Effects CS6 but we don't have any Adobe After Effects CS5 or CS4 or CS3 but this way the second type the second ability I'm going to show you how to make it read the text any of Adobe After Effects versions we can have it in Adobe After Effects CS4, CS3 and others but I'm going to show you it in Adobe After Effects CS6 ok here we go and this is Adobe After Effects CS6 CS6 now first of all we'll do is we create a new composition here let it just 30, 30 seconds to create no need just just let it so this is our space our workspace here our workplace we're gonna make a project here and and the second step is that to make a new text just by clicking in here and this in this button or just come to layer new layer new text control plus health plus shift plus T alright and we just click here and create a text and we type text Just type with whatever you want. Just to have it like this. Okay, guys. As we can see that in this tutorial, we can we can see that this is just in 2D text. So first of all, before we choose a layer, another layer, we just make this in 3D text. If you don't have this, uh, this options, we just click and toggle switches moves. Just like this, we have we don't have here. But we we'll click here and make this this box right here. It's 3D. Make it 3D. Now the text is in 3D dimensions. So and second of all, and what do you do? Just layer new camera. This is it. And now we have a camera, and just we come to this option here, and we can see that we have a 3D space. But the text is not actually in 3D dimensions. As you can see, it's not in 3D, but absolutely we're gonna make it 3D, and it looks awesome. It's gonna be a lot, right? All what we do, we don't use this option. We come and you change the geometry and go to geometry, geometry options. But we have another way. First thing we do, we we click on this text, and in our keyboard we click P, just go to a position. Right, we have here a position, and we click on Alt and this stopwatch, and we have this this area and this transient this transform position. We write value value plus open brackets zero comma zero comma no comma index comma index and close the bracket now we just type this value plus open brackets zero comma zero comma index close brackets and like we have this transition right and we have to make this in 3d and we have just to duplicate this text it's about just 
30 times or just what you like but it's gonna be better to have it in 30 times or more and we have just to do edit and go to duplicate you say here edit duplicate control plus D and we come to the text duplicate it in 30 times better now if we if we come to this and all that we're gonna do is that to link all these duplicated texts texts to this one and move it to move with it right here I select from 29 to 1 duplicate the text and we come around here and we have just to link all these duplicated texts to the tur to 31 here to do this text and now we can see all right now we can see that we have a 3d text without using the second options we just use this option is better and more easier so guys uh, this is this is lot 3d but it's not a little bit completed so we have to add something to be more beautiful and all that we have just to do is that to select all this options here select all control a that control and disable camera and all what we do is just come to here and change this color to another color and we just make it like this uh, uh, better this color squeeze it's good now as we can say this is better it's completely in 3d text sorry can you say it is in 3d text and we have lock right here say it's in 3d text as it seems so with using this this way this uh, this is awesome and we, we no longer need a cinema 40 or 3d max studio we have it now in Adobe after effects any versions we also could make some lights to make it a little bit realistic just to go to a layer new light where is it light here just make cut shadows sleep little white it's better all what we have just to make it to add just one light here just to be impacted all right as we can see now oh, it's good and we can have it for so thank you for watching this is the way how to make it and please subscribe and we'll be waiting for another videos and tutorials coming soon please subscribe uh, joseph send me in youtube my channel right see you later